of Shane Dawson videos lately. If you guys don't know who Shane Dawson is, he's basically like a conspiracy theory videoer. I mean, he's pretty famous, so I think most of you would know who he is. But basically, I've been binging his videos a lot lately. Like, a few years ago, I started watching his videos, and then I kind of stopped, and now I started again. And I was inspired to share my personal conspiracy theories with you guys. So, um, yeah, get this roll on a- wait, okay, no. I'm sorry. So, my first conspiracy theory is that the moon is non-existent. I know what you're thinking, like, Kaylee, the moon, of course, is, um, it, of course, it exists. You see it all the time in the night sky, right? And then there was, like, the guy who landed on the moon and stuff. So, I know that there's this conspiracy theory that, like, the moon landing was fake or whatever and like, I don't know, it was like some green screen or something. But I'm taking it one step further and saying the moon doesn't exist at all, okay? And like, before you just completely deny this theory, just think about it, okay? Have you ever been on the moon? No. So how do you know it's real? And it could be a projection in the sky, like, you don't know. And automatically assume that it's the moon, but it might not be. You see where I'm getting with here? This sounds kind of interesting. Did you guys hear that? It was like, this month? This sounds <laughs> Considering I got this video idea like from Shane Dawson's channel in a way, and this conspiracy is saying that he's not real. He is real, but he, what if he's like hired by the government? Whenever there was like somebody that I didn't really want to like share my like life with, but they seemed like they wanted to get to know a lot about me, I'll share little like small details about my life that are kind of insignificant. And when you share like really small details with someone, they feel like they know a lot about you, but they really don't know a lot about you. So maybe Shane Dawson is doing that. He gives us conspiracy theories, right? But they're like really insignificant conspiracy theories. Like the Chuck E. Cheese one, for example. I mean like, yeah, that's kind of like important because people eat Chuck E. Cheese pizza, but like it's kind of a bad example, whatever. Maybe the government Maybe, like, the government is giving him, like, fake conspiracy theories in a way, but they're, like, small details, right? They're, like, the Chuck E. Cheese thing. You feel like you're woke, but in reality, you're not woke, my dude. He could be a dog in a suit. Like, we wouldn't know. Next theory. So, my next theory is that the Earth is flat. And, okay, I know a lot of these theories may sound unreal to you, but I feel like this one's the most believable out of all of them. You know, the Earth could be flat, like, there's also no proof that it's round when you think about it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, then go like this video, you know, just like casually, just like, <laughs> um, and then subscribe if you haven't already to my channel, because that would be fun. And, um, oh, actually, I'll be, like, subscribe to my channel if you, like, haven't already. You know, it's just, like, uh, blah. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, comment. LA. Um, I don't even know if this is, like, an LA accent, but, like, I don't know. People just call it that, but, like, I don't even know, you know what I mean? Like, uh, I'm having, like, some weird identity crisis right now. Without further ado, adios amigos. Everybody got the reason, everybody got the way